Then they had this meeting in person uh, to discuss in the last 24 hours about the fee, but they already knew that coming there and offering 100 million package was the way to sign Modric in few hours. Hey guys, welcome back on the channel, Fabrizio Romano here with the breaking news of the day, the exclusive news of the day, Mikhailo Modric to Chelsea. And now guys, let's enter into the details of the story because it's done. Mikhail Modric will play for Chelsea. Let's jump into it. And so guys, we can say Mikhailo Mudrik to Chelsea, here we go, the deal is now done and completed, everything is fine on club side, because Chelsea and Shakhtar Donetsk have an agreement, but also on player side, on a long term contract, so let's enter into the details of this crazy 24 hours, I will give you an exclusive video tomorrow to explain you all the details of this story, all the secrets of this story, also to answer some of your questions, as I saw many messages on social media, so I wanted to clarify something, but now it's important to give you the news, Mikhailo Mudrik is in London right now, the player is in London with his agents, flying from Turkey to London in order to get uh, the contract signed and to do his medical on Sunday. So medical booked, contracts ready. The contract of Mikhailo Mudrik with Chelsea will be valid until June 2030. So a super long contract, seven here and half. The same Chelsea did with Benoit Badiashil from Monaco, now will be for Mikhailo Mudrik. So contract ready and agreed. Also important to mention, between Chelsea and Shakhtar, the fee will be 100 million euros. If you want me to tell you a small secret, is 99.9 to be 100% precise, but of course the reality is 100 million euros for Mikhailo Mudrik from Shakhtar Donetsk to Chelsea. What happens in the last 24 hours? That Chelsea board, Chelsea owners and board were flying to meet directly with Shakhtar to negotiate as exclusively revealed during the afternoon, and so, the negotiation was very fast because Chelsea, after meeting with Shakhtar director Dario Serna last week in London during a Chelsea City game, then they had this meeting in person uh, to discuss in the last 24 hours about the fee, but they already knew that coming there and offering 100 million package was the way to sign Modric in a few hours. So, full agreement really fast between Chelsea and Shakhtar on the fee, and right after they started to push on player side with the meeting with the agents of the player. The meeting was not easy because we know that Modric's priority was Arsenal. Modric wanted Arsenal as priority move. Modric was dreaming of Arsenal as club for his future, but what happened? Chelsea started to present their project for the future. Uh, Chelsea started to tell him about the possibility to be a starter in the starting 11 of Potter immediately, right now. And so we know that Shakhtar uh, and Chelsea spoke for a long time, Ch Shakhtar and Arsenal spoke for a long time also about the official bid. They made a third bid, Arsenal, on Thursday. 70 million euros plus 25 in add-ons, but what happened with Chelsea is that after the agreement between clubs, in this meeting during Saturday afternoon with the agents of the player, they convinced him, thanks to the project of course, but also thanks to important money, important salary to Mikhailo Mudrik and also important commission to the agents. So this is Chelsea, how they agreed on player side, but also the agreement on club side to be really, really fast. So Chelsea promised to Mudrik to be part of the starting 11 immediately, to be a really important player immediately for uh, Chelsea. And also, why Mudrik said yes? It's not just uh, about all the things you can see around, but there is an important factor. For Shakhtar, the bid was 100 million. They were only going to accept 100 million euros. So Arsenal were not going to offer guaranteed 100 million euros, but less than this, 70 plus 25 in add-ons, and add-ons are not always easy. So the Chelsea one is almost guaranteed 100 million euros, and so Shakhtar told the player, if you don't accept Chelsea and Arsenal don't match the bid, the only way is for you to stay here and move in the summer. So Mudrik, instead of staying at Shakhtar six more months, he decided to accept Chelsea because he knew that Arsenal were only offering what they did as their best. But on this Arsenal story, I will release another video tomorrow to explain you what really happened. And so Mudrik to Chelsea. Here we go. And so guys, let me know your thoughts on this Mikhailo Mudrik deal, he's joining Chelsea, incredible move, I wait for your opinion here in the comments, like this video, turn on the notification bell, as always, subscribe to the channel, as you can see, mad days, and see you soon, with Fabrizio, ciao!